The MicroPower Plus Oral Max Elite High Speed Drill is specifically designed for oral surgery procedures. This video reviews proper cleaning, sterilization, and maintenance to ensure your powered instruments run smoothly. Please follow universal precautions for protective apparel when handling and cleaning contaminated instruments. Clean the instruments within 30 minutes after use to minimize the potential for blood and debris drying. To begin proper cleaning of the handpiece, remove the burr guard, electric cord, and cutting tools from the handpiece. Thoroughly scrub the handpiece with a clean soft brush dampened with a mild pH balance detergent with a pH of 10.5 or less. Do not submerge the handpiece during cleaning. Manipulate all moving parts of the handpiece to ensure all debris is removed. Then, remove all traces of soap by rinsing the handpiece and attachments under running tap water with a minimum temperature of 25 degrees Celsius or 77 degrees Fahrenheit for a minimum of 30 seconds using a minimum of 6 liters of water. Keep the nose of the handpiece pointed downward during rinsing, but be careful to prevent direct water exposure to the electrical connector. Flush all surfaces free of tap water with distilled water at a minimum temperature of 25 degrees Celsius or 77 degrees Fahrenheit for a minimum of 20 seconds using a minimum of 4 liters of water. Ensure that the handpiece is visibly free of detergent or cleaning residue. Then, gently shake the equipment free of water and wipe the surfaces with a clean, lint-free towel. Dry the contacts thoroughly to prevent corrosion. Prior to sterilization, visually inspect the handpiece and accessories under good lighting conditions to check for visible soil and corrosion. To clean the burr guard, thoroughly scrub it with a clean soft brush dampened with a mild pH balanced detergent. Remove debris from the cannulation of the burr guard by feeding in the wire end of a cleaning brush completely through. Repeat the process until all debris is removed. Flush the inside and outside surfaces with running water to prevent accumulation of coagulated material. Then, flush the tap water from the surfaces with distilled water to prevent metal discoloration. Do not immerse the Burgard in any solution, as immersion will damage the equipment. Gently shake the Burgard free of as much water as possible. Then wipe the surface with a clean, lint-free towel. The Burgard is now ready for sterilization. The universal cable should be cleaned by wiping down the surface with a clean, lint-free cloth dampened with a mild pH balanced detergent. All traces of soap should be removed by wiping down the cable with a clean cloth dampened with distilled or sterile water. Take care not to expose the connector to water or soap. Dry the power cord using a lint-free cloth. With the MicroPower Plus system components manually cleaned, sterilization can begin using a steam autoclave process. Do not peel pack hand pieces for sterilization. Sterilization in a seal pouch traps moisture which can cause damage. Sterilization can be completed using an FDA cleared sterilization wrap or sterilization tray. Refer to your MicroPower Plus Instruction Manual's sterilization instructions to confirm the minimum temperature, exposure, and dry cycle times specific to your steam sterilization method. ConMed recommends that your MicroPower Plus Oral Max Elite handpiece and burr guard be returned for service every six months. In addition, ConMed offers extended service programs that assist you in the care and maintenance of your equipment for one to four years. Please contact your local sales representative to find out more about these service programs.